this ain't that bad, you know. This is kind of cool. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Saved it there just briefly, but welcome to a new game, a new type of game, com something completely random, but it will make sense the further we go down the line. Welcome to Cooking Simulator. Whoa. Yeah, I was, I was looking for games, you know, just a little something to do in the spare time and whatnot. You know, try to play around a bit. And I came across this, Cooking Simulator. Now, you're probably going to know quite a bit about me in this episode, because believe it or not, man is a chef. I, I have worked, and I still do. <laughs> I work in an area that uses food, a restaurant. So we're, I'm quite good. I'm very good. I, I know my stuff. So I feel like this, with that combining with this game, might make it more fun for me, but you know, we're just gonna go around and play around with it. Um, new game. Let's go. Um, career mode. Ultimate cooking challenge, sandbox. We might just play a bit of sandbox first, just to see how the game works. Um, and then maybe we'll go to career mode and whatnot. Let's just start this up and see what happens, because, I don't know. Just a little bit of fun, you know? Why not? Something completely random. We do like diversity. So, uh... I mean, there's nothing much really to say, except for the fact we got to wait for this uh, loading screen. So, uh, we'll wait. So, how's your day been? <laughs> oh. Oh, okay. Music cut. Hi. Say less. Whoa, look where we are. Are we in the city? Where are we? Those buildings are way too con convoluted. But this is our kitchen. Look at it. Oh. Oh, this is where we keep all our stuff. Because who doesn't love stuff? Freaking hate pumpkin. <laughs> but walk to the kitchen. Uh, this kitchen is quite massive, actually. Not as big as the kitchen I work in. But, you know, this will do. This will do. Um. Oh, bro. The old favorite. The, this is the this is the most common cheating device right here. A microwave. Mad. We have a dartboard and a gas canister. We have a dartboard. I don't know why we have a dartboard. But yeah, this is it. This is our fridge, 3.9 degrees. Whether or not th that must be Celsius, can't be Fahrenheit. Um, which is good, optimal fridge temperature. Okay, if this, okay. Um, we're in the fridge right now and by God. Okay. Um, not exactly sure as to why we have um, milk next to some raw chicken. Um, th that can't run. I mean, if an inspector came in here, we would we would get we would get jail time probably. But th that's not a good sign. Why have we got cheese underneath fish? Like, what what's going on here? Why why is this? Oh, we've got nice little fruit and veg though. Lime, lemon, mozzarella, and radish. Thought they were cherries for a second since we've got strawberries in here. I mean, we got raw meat, we got cheese, and then we got raw meat. <laughs> okay, um, let's just not mention that to anyone, and hopefully no one comes in. It seems to be just me. I'm gonna single-handedly run a kitchen. Um, what's that? A barrel of dark beer. Barrel of light beer. Okay, interesting. We have easy access to drink alcohol. Good to know. Um. Okay. All right. Um. Well, enough. Enough walking around. Let's uh, let's go and do something. I guess we head over here. What's this? I have a book. Throw advanced controls. Oh. Okay. I guess this is how I will position certain food items. That might be a little bit awkward. Okay. So I can take a picture of my food. I guess what's this? Now playing cooking jazz. Now playing on MP3 folder, empty folder. Alright, we'll turn that off. Alright, okay. Decorations. I can decorate my kitchen. I want to choose something. Ah, here we go. Order. It seems I just tell people what to order. Steak with french fries. Very basic, but very traditional. You know what? I'm going to press order. How do I get order? Oh, we have orders. Oh, we got two. Oh, well, all right, okay then. How do I get out? Right, we've, we've got two orders, it seems. 
Uh, steak with fries and steak with fries. Okay, we serve it. Steak, salt and pepper. All right, okay. So I guess we'll grab the chopping board. I assume it's all. We only have the one chopping board. But then again, this is like a very classic kitchen. Uh, right, steak is in the fridge. Uh, this is it, right? Steak, steak, boom. I got two of them. Okay. I can't seem to separate them. I guess I'll have to do that. Okay, that'll do. Um, salt? I think that's what it said. It said salt and pepper. I can view it on all sides. Good to know. Uh, four grams of salt, four grams of pepper. All right, okay. Okay. See how that goes. And white pepper, black pepper. Oh, can't sprint, but you know. Uh, so we put it on this one and a bit of this one. All right, okay. So now, we've done that, we now need to fry it. Um, I think we can just use this, I assume this is a griddle, isn't it? Yes it is! Alright, okay. So we go, put that there, go. I'm just holding it with my hands. Right, I guess I would wash my hands at this point, but does it... How do I do it? Is there a way to do it? Well, I, I've done it. Alright, again, okay. just just believe me on that one. Um, what is... Right, potatoes, that's what we need next. How are they cooking? Okay, they're almost there. They're almost ready to be flipped. Uh, potato. I have 150. I don't know how many I need. Potato. Just stick them on here. I've, I don't know if there's any too much of an issue. I'm kind of curious. Okay. These sticks nearly done, conveniently. Spatula's here. How do, I, how do I know when it's done? Alright, now it's done. Okay, I need to rotate it. Okay. Stick that on there. Rotate it. Ah, oh, cool. Nice. This is actually going quite well. Alright. So I grab my potatoes. And I believe... Is this what I think it is? Put it in here. And it... Oh, yes. Oh, look at that. That is cool. They're not fries, though, but I don't see, like, anything that can resemble fries. So, uh, fill. Turn on. I guess we got to go and stick all of our... It'd be better to tip it in. Tip it in. Where is it going? Oh. Alright, well, I got most of them, but let us go and grab our stuff. Let me grab, just grab two plates. Assume it's done, yeah. Alright, well, I got two plates now. I'm gonna need another plate. Okay, so far it seems to go quite alright, actually. Um, just stick that over there for now. Stick that here. Uh, what did you wait on? Chips, and they're almost done. It's a good job there's like a timer here, actually, shows you. And done. Okay, now we need to try and pour it onto two separate plates. Rotate, um, how do I pour it? Rotate forward. How, how, how much of a physics is going to be in here? Just stick that there. I can't pick it up. Have I got like tongs anywhere? Um. Apparently I don't. Right, this is a bit of an issue. Right, can I just put this on here? I can. Put it. Is it gonna go? Where is it gonna go? Alright, that'll do. That will do. Uh. Ah. Rotate. Forward. Yo, portion control's a bit of madness, but um. Shove that there. <laughs> shove that there. Shove that there. Shove that. I can't, I can pick all of them up except that one. Alright, uh, okay. Um, Alright, what X? Just rosemary twigs? Alright, okay. Uh, I don't know how much money they spent for this, but... Uh, here we go. Do I have to send them both? Hang on. If I do that. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Uh, okay, I did it. 
uh, four star for taste, five star for realization time, and four star for overall score. Guest is pleased. All right, say less. Right, let's go do the other one. Can I pick this up now? Nope, that's fine. I think this guy got probably a little bit more. Uh, two of them. I think one of them must have fallen off. It's fine. Let's see what this one says. Okay, less than four star. Uh, overall score. But the guest is pleased. Oh, guest complaints. French fries. Oh, I didn't put any salt on the potato. And wrong amount of product. I don't know where the temperature is perfect. Cool. Alright, yo, bro. Bro, we chefing, bro. We chefing. Alright, where is chips, though? I had to... Do I have to... Because I'd assume I had to make my own chips. But obviously, yeah. Uh, wedges but yo whoa man we did that bro it's a little bit of pressure there i'm not too sure as to how much was there but we did all right we did all right all right okay so this is pretty much i think i understand how this works now let's switch that off um wow okay i can't leave can i what we got here um what is this simple ukrainian boar Borscht. <laughs> what? Can I know what that is? Chicken broth, salt, pepper, beetroot, onion, carrot. Mm. Not a big fan of beetroot, you know, to be honest. Um, fast pumpkin soup. Alright. Gaz, gaz, gaz pacho, gaz pacho. Is that right? Um, hmm. Salmon with asparagus, salmon in butter sauce with asparagus. Oh wow, can't even read. Um, salmon steak with boiled potatoes. Try and make a. Not a big fan of fish, to be honest. Then again, I'm not the one eating it, so you know. Let's go with let's go with a soup, bro. Order. We have an order. Order. How do I? Oh yeah, close. Really awkward controls, I have to admit. All right, what am I making? Cucumber, tomato, pepper, garlic, bread, and a blender. All right, say less. We have a blender. I just need to what, what? Just whack them all in here. Don't need to cut them or anything. No, it literally just says. Uh, three twenty. Okay. Uh, I just got fine. What? Okay. I can't remember what it was. Bread and garlic. Okay. Well, I guess we'll grab bread. Uh, grab a bit of garlic. I think there was mention of a red bell pepper. Uh, is this a cucumber? That is. Oh, no, that's a zucchini. But, um, hang on. Take that out. What's this? Throw it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. Uh, where's a cucumber then? Right here. I think it said 248. I'm not too sure of the measurements. This is a lot going in for one portion. Um, I guess tomatoes, is that what it was? I'm kind of making it up as I go along here. Yeah, that was tomatoes, isn't it? Alright, I think that's it, isn't it? Maybe we'll add a bit more garlic. Oh, I think something might have fallen off. Just add a bit more garlic, just a little bit. What did I lose? I lost a tomato. Okay, we'll add that back. Okay, blend it. On. Wow. Okay. I think it's blended now. Um, what do I need? Add olive oil, white wine vinegar, and salt and black pepper to the blender. Okay, right. So I grab 10 grams of salt and pepper. No. Right, I'm gonna have to. What I'll do is I'll take this out, move it here. Grab the pepper, move it here. All right, 10 grams. Ten grams of that. I don't know how I'd measure that out. I would literally just do like a, a, a pinch, but you know. Uh, wine vinegar, must be one of these bottles here. Uh, red wine, honey, white wine. Is it white wine vinegar? I think it just said wine vinegar. Am I reading right? I can't read. Wine vinegar and olive oil. Okay, we're going to assume that is olive oil. Who knew? 
had olives on it. Uh, how many did it say? I think it said 30. Oh well, there's a lot more than 30 in there, but you know, it'll do. Uh, wine vinegar. Am I just reading that wrong? White vinegar? Uh, rice vinegar, balsamic, wine vinegar. Alright, okay, I found the right one. Um, how many do I need? 30. 29, alright, okay. Okay, right, well, I've done it, and I just need to pour the liquid into a deep plate. Uh, must be one of these, yep. Put it in here. Oh, slight. There, there. Alright, well, it's pouring. Okay, oh, we're kind of pouring a bit of it. Uh, garnish with chives, 8 grams. Chives must be these things, yep. 2, 4, 6, 8. Alright, okay. Is that it? Let's see. Oh, four star, five star realization to four star overscore. Guess this, please. Guess complaints. Gas patio technique, wrong amount of product. Well, I think it might. Have, I think I, I don't know because like, it was the ingredients to begin with. It, I don't think I was meant to put like whole. Oh, well, I can't see. Oh, and I've probably maybe because I spilt it all. <laughs> it's a bit of a mess, but um, mad. All right, okay. So this is. This is pretty much how it works. There's a gas canister and a flame fryer. Now, what are you trying to tell me, game? Wow, I must be strong as hell to throw that, bro. I can barely lift these things. You mean to tell me I can just chuck them halfway across the kitchen? Ah, uh, okay. Ooh. Potato dumplings. Penny. Fusilli. I love fusilli. That's some good stuff right there. Red currant jelly, star shine, cinnamon sticks. Why would I need to make these? Like, what, what, what has like cinnamon sticks on it? Like that. That's my question. What has cinnamon sticks? It must be some. It must be with some like something. <laughs> it must be with something. Um, mad. Okay. Oh wow. A hamburger. There's cheese in it though. Does that make it a cheeseburger? Should we just make a hamburger? Let's make a burger. Top bun. Bottom bun, take burger meat, salt, pepper, fry, drizzle and ketchup, transfer to a plate, cheddar, tomato, onion, burger bun. Right, okay, this might be a little bit complicated, but, oh, I've made two. Um, we'll, we'll only cook one, there's only meant to be one, um, I just this somewhere. Yeah, that'll do. Alright. A hamburger. Burger bun add to a baking tray. Why am I baking bread? Is it right, where's a baking tray? Do I not have one? Is this it? I think this might be it. It looks like it. Right, let us go and grab bottom bun. I can only grab one thing at a time. I like put it on the plate, right, come here. Oh, okay, well, physics. Bottom, top. Uh, whack it in here. All right, 30 seconds. Um, take burger meat, okay, we'll, um. <laughs> Look at this! That's a bit of a mess. Um, don't do that. Don't throw glass bottles everywhere. All right, okay, I think that's done. All right, buns are toasted. I would have normally have done it on the griddle, but you know, we move. Um, oh wow, I, oh man, there's so many screens everywhere. Okay, so I need uh, burger meat. Where's the burger at? 112, what does it say? Yeah, there's only just one burger. Okay, uh, let's just whack it on here for now. We'll season it as we cook it. It seems to be a viable strategy. I don't know how much it said. Uh, three and three. Okay, well, uh, I put six, so I'll put five. I think only 3% of that actually went on the griddle. 
Um, fry on each side. All right, okay. Um, I need my spatula thingy. We gotta wait here. What was that? This is just me. I'm just like whacking the fridge with the spatula. No, I'm whacking the spatula with the fridge. Wait, hang on a minute. That doesn't. Oh, I'm getting distracted. All right, okay. All right. Hold on. Rotate. Cool. Look at that. All right, okay. So, what else do I need? Burger meat for on each side. Transfer onto a plate. I think we'll just do a normal large plate. I don't think we need a massive plate for this. Um, I want the bottom bun to go there. Uh, how much longer on a burger? Right, burger's not that long. Ketchup, which I can only assume is this thing. Um, or... Oh, okay, well that's, that's not how ketchup works, but whatever. Whatever. Okay, I think I'm meant to fry some onions. Are we just going to stick raw onion on there? I think we'll just fry an onion. Hang on. Take that. Put it... Right, you know what? Just whack it back on here. Turn that off. And then bring the plate over and it should hopefully go on the burger it didn't go on the burger oh my god um what the hell happened here i don't have tongs in what kitchen do we not have tongs i have a ladle just stick that there stick that there grab the burger there we go that'll do Right, now we need cheese and then tomato and onion. My chopping board seems to have disappeared somewhere. It's over here. Okay. All right. Stick that there. We'll just assume that it's washed. I mean, I know it's not, but for some reason, I can't seem to even wash my hands in this kitchen. So we'll have to make do with what we got. Um, make... What am I getting again? I need an onion. Uh, an onion. That automatically comes skinned. Oh man, that would be so much helpful. Oh, a knife. Wait, I actually have to cut it. Right, okay. How does this work then? Like this, apparently. Onion slices? I mean, I like onions, so you know... I don't think, I don't know. Is it better to have diced onion, or... Well, I can't seem to dice it up any further than it already is. Um, so I'm just stick that there. Am I putting raw onion onto it? You know what? No, no. That us uh, move vertically, rotate. Oh, there we are. That'll do. That'll do. We'll fry some onions. Uh, then we'll add cheese. Have we got cheese? Is there like sliced cheese, or am I gonna have to cut the cheese as well? I'm probably gonna have to cut the cheese as well. I just cut it on the thing. Oh, okay, I don't exactly know how to get a sliced cheese out of this. Rotate around. Okay, those onions are going to be done, like, really fast. Okay, turns out it's going to be a hefty slice of burger, but for some reason it wouldn't let me, um, take less, and it's... It's on its freaking side. Uh, rotate. Put it... Oh, wow. Come on. Uh, oh, I left my fridge open. Right, oh, what am I doing? Right, okay, I don't need that. Um, yeah, the onions are definitely done. Definitely done. Right, um, I'm trying to get this freaking cheese to go on the right way. There we go. I just want to add it. Why does it do that? Why does it make it vertical? That is annoying. These controls. Uh, drop. Just, just whack it on the plate as it is. Okay, well, I got it to sit down. Right, whack some onions on it. Okay, this is sliding off. Uh, right. I think it's missing a tomato. 
Just whack the tomato in as a whole. <laughs> Alright. Let me just use this other knife now that that one's on the floor. Um, boom. I know it's probably meant to be slices, but these physics are annoying me. Alright, and then just top it with the bucket button. Put them down. Give me this. Alright, well, it's a really weird burger. Let's just see what they think. I think it's... Damn. I don't have the, the hands for it one star. <laughs> Five star realisation time. I did it on time easily, but I just tasted what was there. Not enough ketchup. Bro, I poured literally enough to fill freaking the Atlantic Ocean. What do you mean not enough? Too much pepper. Uh, wrong amount. Heating mistakes. What do you mean? You wanted it toasted. But the temperature was perfect. Well, that was a bit of annoying ending, to be honest. But I'm actually going to end this here. Thank you guys so much for watching. And until we are graced with a chance to meet again, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell. And until the next time, we'll probably go into career mode. I mean, th 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 this game is not that bad. The controls are very janky. I've left that on. Um, it's, it's very, like, I couldn't get... I'm not very precise. I know there's, like, a... A VR version of this game, which might be a bit easier because I could use my hands and make everything all nice. Um, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. And uh, yes, until then. <laughs>